Today, I'm going to teach you how to make a perfect dumpling. This, I believe, is my grandma's recipe that I've used for years and years and years. Let's get cooking. The first thing that we start with is a cup of flour. So I've got my cup of flour. We'll put it in the bowl. And then a half a cup of milk. Got that here. Half a cup of milk. One egg. A teaspoon of baking powder. A half a teaspoon of salt, and I like to use the, the pink salt and the palm of my hand. That looks about right to me. Okay. And then pepper. And I used I like to use this the big pepper that you grind. I like a lot of pepper in the dumplings. But you just do what you want to do. And then stir it up. Could have got my whisk out, but you know I didn't. When you're done, the consistency should be kind of like this. Alright, I've got a pot of soup oil in here from like leftover chicken. And what I'm going to do is take this teaspoon and get little blobs of this dough, the mixture that we just made up, and just drop it in there. So let's do that. About this size, whatever you want. And just drop them all around. Now that you have all that dropped in there, you want to get the lid. Put the lid on it for, oh, about 10 minutes. And don't take the lid off. Leave the lid on there. All right, are you ready for this? Perfect dumplings. Every time. Look at there. Isn't that good looking stuff? And they always taste good. So leave the lid on the pan for, I have it on low. I had it on high, it was boiling for a little bit. Then I turned it on low and put the dumplings in and then just put the lid on top of it. 10 minutes, that's all it took. All right, I will leave the recipe for this in my description. If you wanna try my grandma's dumplings. If you like my video, I'm, I guess I'm a baker now. Come back for more, subscribe, and I'll see you later, bye. Thank you.